I'm gonna keep it 100. This game looks really weird right now to me. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> it looks really weird to me right now. Like just, this is like- It's injustice, bro. Oh no. Yo, what's going on YouTube? I'm gonna be watching Catchman Mustard's breakdown on the new system mechanics. I think they talk about cameos. They show a couple combos. Um, I'm with Scar on this reaction as well. What's the deal? There is gonna be a lot of information very fast, so strap yourselves in, let's go. First of all, the <coughs> up block. A new defensive mechanic. Holding block and pressing up will activate almost like a parry. It beats jump-ins, it beats overheads, and who knows what else it beats. We didn't get to test it thoroughly. However, a successful up block will open the opponent up for that a new flawless punish. block. And that's just, that's mm. We're showing off a couple of Liu Kang moves here, but the big thing we what do in the? this moment is with a fatal blow. We want to look at how long it takes to come back. And the big thing you would have noticed there, a cinematic startup which was something that I think this mechanic definitely needed. Yeah, so that mechanic definitely back. needed. <laughs> yeah. From whiff or block, sure, but ultimately, you know, it, it's, it's not just going to be like a desperation move. Oh, like they're moving kind of weird. Yeah, yeah bro, it is super moves, weird, bro. Right right now, are they so like... Uh, movement, right? So it's dashing no. instead of running, but you cannot cancel dash with block. Nah, in this game. You have to commit to it, but you can cancel crazy. with a movement option. What is that? So I wonder how the so high level open movement is going to look at this. Wave dashing, but we are back to dash movement, but it's dash movement that you can't block out of. What you're looking at right now is our first attempt at cameos and a few extra strings kind of sprinkled in there. This is a chopped up version of our first ever impressions and time playing the game. So a lot of this that you're seeing here is using it for the first time. What you saw right there, Sub-Zero's back too. That is a single button, but it launches yeah, this, and leads yeah, into a full This combo. is an overhead as well. This is a launching overhead that Sub-Zero has, leads to good damage, very unsafe on block, but that kind of go-to- Man, I feel like, like this is like a if MK slash Injustice. Now, a lot of Liu Kang's buttons seem to be quite kind of feeling. MK11, right? He's got the forward mm. four, he's got the standing three yeah, kicks. Yeah, for you just see when you get your hands on that, yeah. Um, yeah, you see it the right there. Gonna be lit. Gonna, basically, if you put your opponent in a high enough juggle state, you get Get access to new aerial strings in the air that work exclusively for juggle combos. It's really interesting. I we don't know how so deep you have your starter combo. Man. It's certainly brand new. I wonder how the actual hell which you can see it again. Sub zeros are one two in the air will do that splat. He's the only character. I just wonder how that the actual hell is how a level gonna look like in this game. Not uh, universal yeah. options. Some characters it's gonna look the others pause. But it all right, pause. I'm gonna keep it one hundred. Cause I always keep 100. I don't shake your coat. Shit. Yeah. This game looks really weird right now to me. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> it looks really weird to me right now. Like just this is like it's injustice, bro. You get you get a little bit of that injustice. You know what I mean? Oh no. Well, like maybe Look when people dashes, bro. You ma feel me? Maybe when people start fighting and combos are not dropped and shit like that, and niggas are hitting big big damage combos. I, I like th I think they say I think. Ketchup must have said that that dash that they did you can't block out of them. So it's kind of like a commitment to the dash. No, I understand that, but I'm saying like, it just looks really weird. Everything kind of looks weird when you first see it, but. I mean, but we should be used to that because that's just like, that's how these games go, bro. You yeah, know what I think MK11 <laughs> looked weird and I got really used to how it looked. So, you know, this show probably feel normal. Yeah. Flawless block. Flawless block is back. However, it prevents chip and it prevents meter gain for the opponent, but it also does not lead to as many options before. It's, and that's yeah, a big it's, change. It's basically done for individual attacks. You're not gonna be doing attacks or launchers or whatever out of it. It is purely done to negate chip and meter build of the opponent. So it's back, but it's not gonna be as front row and center. That is so good. I hated that mechanic. Flaws block? Three bars yeah. that we did not record. You can break fatal blows. Yeah, for the first time in another own Mortal Kombat. I wonder how that's going to go, bro. You know, it's not going to be that kind of free chunk of damage. It uses very much all of your resources. And remember, Fatal Blow is not tied to the Super Meter anymore. So you're going to have a lot of bar, but you're you going to have to spend blow. a lot of it if you want a combo breaker to come through. I what? That right there is one of the... Good. So they really killed Fatal Blow, bro. While we show yeah. these, we have to mention there are two types of cameo attacks. But maybe I'm tripping. One of them is called a summon, and the other. Oh, you is do an gotta spend all your, your expenses to break. Your 
Base exactly. Area stands still while the cameo comes in. That is a bit more restrictive. However, the ambush version, aka Kano's knife toss or Jax's air grab, you can move while these happen. And the difference between I think this game will look sick with the combo. It's gonna be, that's what I was saying. I was just gonna say that, bro. Like the combo is gonna go crazy. The tag combo is gonna go crazy, bro. They're gonna go crazy. And it's just, it is gonna just gonna, it's gonna come down to the like the movement, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like how does mm -hmm. the movement look? But I think this game looks weird right now because but once you start introducing the cameos, shit's gonna look kinda wild. Yeah. I think it's gonna look sick. Yeah. Oh, they know too. <laughs> the throw game is so heavily based on your cameo that it's going to be We're doing stuff like that, bro. That, you see that corner combo, That's a by the sick way. combo. So it just obviously is your go to wake up. And by the way, Sub's got a dive kick now. No, that is weird. Not only a dive yeah. kick, but a dive kick that you can combo from if he's at the correct height. So Bro. no doubt we're going to be seeing uh, that's weird. Some sort of dive kick. <laughs> the EX flying <laughs> kick. Damn. The EX flying kick for Liu Kang does grant you a launch. Now these combos, I gotta say, it's actually very simple compared to what we would eventually learn. What you're looking at right now is our first ever time with the game. We were fortunate enough to have a little bit of extra time, not to record, but obviously the sake of fairness and everything else, but to sit and just play and learn. And I cannot stress enough that what you're seeing here isn't even scratching the surface. I really want to see what they came up with. In this build. I bet you we're going to see the weirdest, like the, possibilities are just the weirdest characters being really good at complimenting each other. Yeah. We're going to see like Sub-Zero and fucking Total Khan being a perfect combination like that shit's gonna be a top tier team like <laughs> it's gonna take so much experimenting to see what cameo with what character is the best combination in the game like you gotta figure out what's the best character in the game and then you gotta figure out what cameo complements that character the you best. gotta figure out what's broke and what makes what cameo is gonna make it super broke yeah yeah <laughs> yeah, and that's gonna be like any character that you pick up, man. Like, if your character mediocre, you yeah. pick the strongest uh, cameo. Yeah, that's why what they call it, uh, synergy. Like off of recording, and there are so many more combos. From Yo, this game like, is gonna be so nuts with the, the combos. Yeah. Go, but they have to read some of these cameos do some sick shit. Really just opens up so much. When we were playing after I love Kano's. I think that Jacks so uh, uh, that, that Jacks one is nasty, bro. bro. I love the Kano one. Move, you know, like not that one, the laser beam. Out of beam. The extensions are rather extensive. And even right there, that that normally would work, and then the you could finish it into something funny, else. But you do kind of get used to it. Like, oh, you do for sure. It just takes time. Like, don't expect to just pick. And you can call your like cameo in, in twice minutes. on a combo. You feel me? Gravity mid combo seems to be at least in this build incredibly generous. So the point is, day one with this kind of game, I can't wait to see what people are going to come up. With. Yeah, but even they remind me of Supergirl like being <laughs> facts. Like, or stuns or whatever. Just pick a cameo that does, and that instantly is going to make up for it. Like, like I really don't know what it's going to lead to to making a character good or not in this game. But that's going to be it for today's video. We wanted to be quick fire information, information, information. But on that note, stay tuned. We're going to do a lot more in depth breakdowns. Damn, what a weird game. Not yeah. gonna lie, it's kind of sick. This is just, we're gonna get used to this shit, and this is gonna just be like another MK game. Yep. But it's like, but just seeing it, seeing it for the first time is like, damn. Brand new game, different game. Like, too. look, we see Kano and Sub Zero on the screen right now on an outro. Like, what the fuck? Yep. But um, that's pretty much the end of the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the reaction. It wasn't as much talking as the other reaction videos were, but it was just because I was trying to absorb all that information. What do you think about the game? Wait, like, what do you think? And it's, it's gonna be, like, I, like you said, it's gonna be crazy. Like, we about to see some crazy stuff, bro. We're gonna be coming up with a bunch of crazy tech. It's gonna be wild. But the game, I feel like the game gonna be fast. My only concern is <laughs> if we can get that dashing cleaned up. And we got some high level movement. High level movement, bro, is so crucial to a game looking fun. Yeah. And it, like the fast pace, that's. That's what makes or breaks people like really wanting to love to come watch your game, you know? Man, I was watching some video and something. Uh, I forgot who was talking about it, but they was like, I don't think they want us to like dash and like, what if they made it harder to even do something like that? Or maybe you know, the inputs are just like crazy. Mm -hmm. Hopefully I get the stress test beta code tomorrow. If I got a good connection, I might stream at CEO. Um, this video will probably drop after the video. Yep, appreciate you guys for watching.
Peace.